I recognize your uniform. Um, you're one of those carriers, right? Sure am. Need a message delivered? No, I'm in the market for information, not sending it. And nothing I can do for you. Yeah, so I hear. But uh, and maybe your boss can help me? Our guildmaster? Driscoll? Maybe. I don't know. He has the authority. But you'd have to be a very special case. I don't know about me, but what I'm after is important. You can try to speak to Driscoll, but don't get your hopes up. Story of my life. Where can I find him? In a headquarters, on downtown court, inside the metro station that bears the same name. You'll know it when you see it. And Driscoll, <laughs> you can't miss him. That right, sounds good. Thanks a lot. I'm looking for the Guildmaster. Driscoll, I was told. Well, that'd be me. And who are you? It's not often I see an unfamiliar face. Not from around here, I gather. No, and I'm looking for work. Sorry, pal, but this is a special organization. You can't just waltz in off the street and get a job here. I'm not waltzing. I don't even dance. You think a smart mouth like that's gonna help you get work? Sorry, I'm, I'm just new to everything. I just need to get to know the city, and from what I heard, this seemed to be the best way to do it. And to make an honest wage. I was a pilgrim, if that helps. A pilgrim, you see? I've heard about your kind. It's hardly a recommendation. <sighs> Look, you said you were a special group. What's so special about the Carrier's Guild? We work for the people, not just for cash on the barrel head. Carriers deliver packages and letters all over the city. I did a lot of that as a pilgrim. It's a valuable service. It's priceless. And not just because of the fees we collect, you merc. Packages and letters are information. Information is the lifeblood of a society. It's also the connective tissue. It brings people together. And it can tear them apart. Yeah, I definitely get that. I ah, like hell you do. Pilgrims are just pure play. You don't have any higher purpose. But carriers, the carriers are the trusted stewards of this system of information and connection. In our way, we safeguard society, protect and defend information. We keep people connected to one another. I see what you mean. It sounds like a huge responsibility. Damn right it is. Which is why not every Tom, Dick, Harry, Oh, shady pilgrim is cut out to be a carrier. Please. I just want to help. Is there anything I can do? Yeah, you can just bugger off. Have yourself a wonderful day. Hey, are you sure you don't need me? Looks like you're running low on carriers. Aye. Things have gotten more dangerous than usual lately. Maybe I'm trying to do you a favor by not bringing you in at this particular juncture. I'm a pilgrim. I know danger. Outside the walls, danger. Oh, do you now? I tell you what. How about I give you a little test, and we see how that goes? Works for me. Test away. Okay, hotshot. Let's see what you're made of. First, you need to make your way to the top of a building nearby and bring back a package that was left by one of ours. Should be lying somewhere by a tent. Is that all? <laughs> Don't go anywhere. Ugh! <sighs> 
got it. That was easy. That was quick. Not bad. That was a test. I barely broke a sweat. Hey, don't get cocky, hotshot. That was just a primer. As you'd guess, delivering messages will take you through areas swarming with infected. And sometimes at night. For this test, You'll need to pick up five letters that were dropped in a dark zone when the previous carrier was being chased by the infected. You'll need real skills just to survive, let alone succeed. Piece of cake for a pilgrim, though. Right? <laughs> yep. This sounds more my speed. I see you soon. Not bad, hot shot. Not bad. That hardly qualified as a test. Ha! This last one, mate. You come face to face with customers. This is what the job is about. Connecting people through the letters they send and receive. Reconnecting our fractured society, so to speak. This is where you prove your true worth. I can handle it. Believe it or not, I'm sort of a people person. Oh, you could have fooled me. But I have to admit you're not a fragile type. I'm starting to see some potential. Pull this off, and I might consider letting you take the carrier's oath after all. I just better not get any complaints from the clients. You won't. I promise. Carrier here. Here's a message. Thank you. <sighs> well, it's about time. Um, pardon? It's from my boyfriend. He's finally leaving his wife. Ah, oh, congratulations. My wife and I separated months ago. She was very understanding. I'm just glad Len finally got the courage to be honest to his wife. Now, we can get on with our lives. Hello, I'm from the Carrier's Guild. I have a letter for Barry. Mom? Mommy? It's a letter from Dad. Careful, don't tear the letter when you open it. I won't, Mom. I swear. Bless you, Carrier. You made my son's day. I have a letter for you. Finally. I'm sorry, sir. I brought the letter as soon as it was given to me. 
I'm not upset with you, it's my son. Weeks without hearing from him. Thought he was dead. No concern for his father. I'm thankful for you, Carrier. At least now I know my idiot son is still alive. Hey, Driscoll. Job's done. All packages delivered safely. Well, that's what I want to hear. Conditions than we do. Come by when you can. I've got something for you. Remember, you can always take the metro to get here quicker. Good work, Hotshot. What did you think? All sorts of letters and recipients out there. It's the network, like I said. You just helped expand it. Looks like your carrier material after all. Are you ready and willing to take the oath? Uh, really? Uh, pilgrims aren't that formal. Uh... Maybe that's part of your problem, Hotshot. If you want this, then you'll repeat after me. Fine, let's do this. I, initiate of the Carrier's Guild. I, initiate of the Carrier's Guild. Swear to serve all the citizens of the city equally. Swear to serve all the citizens of the city equally. To face any dangers and safely deliver all mail entrusted to me. To face any dangers and safely deliver all mail entrusted to me. I will do so with the utmost honor and integrity in accordance with the standards of the Carrier's Guild. I will do so with the utmost honor and integrity in accordance with the standards of the Carrier's Guild. By the power granted me by the Carrier's Guild, I hereby proclaim you a full member. Initiate rank. Welcome to the fold, Hotshot. Let me know when you're ready to start. Baby carrier. So much for this being an elite group. Pilgrim? Fuck that shit. Well, what's your problem? You better not become my problem. For all we know, you could be the next Derek waiting to happen. The next who? What the hell are you talking about? Never you mind, baby carrier. Just keep your nose clean around here. And I'll be watching you. Great. Then you can watch me flip you the bird. Oh, great. Baby Carrier's a comedian, too. This place is going to shit. Coming from you, I guess I'm just upholding your legacy. That's just Jack. Ignore him, compañero. It doesn't look like he's gonna let me ignore him. Tranquilo. His bark is worse than his, uh... Chew? Is that the word? Me amo Jaime, by the way. Being a carrier is dangerous. We're a small group, and we rely on each other. So, you're a pilgrim. Good. You've seen and done things. Sometimes, los novatos get people killed. Aiden, uh, did this Derek get someone killed? Luckily, no. Derek was just plain loco, an adrenaline junkie. We all take this seriously, but he was obsessed. In a way, you had to admire his dedication, even if he was fanatical. And so what happened? Turns out, the cabron was also a regular junkie. Scarfed up all the stimulants in the supply lockers like some crazed Pac-Man. Left the other carriers with tough deliveries in the lurch. What became of him? Booted out on his ass. <laughs> no room for a Scarface in the carrier's guild, amigo. Recipe for death and disaster. Let me guess. Jack led the campaign against Derek. And he was very effective, amigo. I'm sure he was. <laughs> 